Hello everybody, it's me Joseph Hotchkiss from Farsone Technology again and in this tutorial I will teach you how to use the one click backup function in Total Recovery Pro 7. The first thing we need to do is open up the program. To open Total Recovery Pro you can go ahead and double click the icon on the desktop or you can navigate through the start menu and open the program from there. The first thing you should see after opening the program is the loading screen. It shouldn't take that long to actually open the program. After the program has loaded, the user interface will show up, allowing you access to all of the program's functions. To do a one-click backup, all you need to do is select one-click backup. As you can see, Total Recovery 7 brings up a screen in which it already has selected which partition to backup and where to put the backup to. By default, Total Recovery 7 Pro will select the partition in which Windows is located on and the destination will be a secondary drive, in this case a USB hard drive. You can always change the destination of the backup by selecting Browse for Location. Changing the destination of your backup is relatively easy. Total Recovery 7 Pro will display all the hard drives in my computer in a very familiar fashion. So as you can see, it is very easy to change where you want to place the backup image to. Once you've selected the backup destination, go ahead and click OK. If you want to add a schedule to your backup, go ahead and click Edit Schedule. The simple Edit Schedule settings should come up and you'll be able to select daily, weekly, monthly, or keep it at the one time only selection. Click OK when you're done. When everything's set how you want it, go ahead and click proceed. All you will need to do is verify that the job is correct and then click next to start the backup. When doing a one-click backup and the destination is a USB hard drive, Total Recovery 7 Pro will automatically make it a boot device. This way both the backup file and the recovery manager are all in one USB hard drive. Once all the boot files are put into the USB hard drive, Total Recovery 7 Pro will start backing up your C partition. As I've stated in the how to create a full backup tutorial video, backing up an entire hard drive is a long process. The time it takes to back up an entire hard drive will be directly proportional to how much space is used on the hard drive. Even though backing up an entire hard drive does take some time, Total Recovery 7 Pro is one of the fastest in the market. Total Recovery 7 Pro is a nice mix between simplicity and power. And that concludes creating a full backup using the one-click backup function in Total Recovery 7 Pro. If you would like to learn more about Total Recovery 7 Pro or learn about any of our other products, visit www.farstone.com. My name is Joseph Hotchkiss and thank you for watching this tutorial.